my beautiful shoppers welcome back i am so excited about today's shopping adventure we are checking out a new store i've never been to it but one of my lovely shoppers told me i have to check out nesto supermarket here in dubai so we are checking out nesto hypermarket and i'm also challenging myself this week one protein five dishes challenge accepted One of my challenges is also to keep the grocery shopping under 1,000 dirhams. Let's see if this happens here in Nesto. So Nesto is considered a budget-friendly supermarket here in Dubai. It's probably comparable to Viva, um, Carrefour probably, but I was told it's less expensive than Carrefour, but more expensive than Viva. So I'm really interested to check it out. What I've seen so far, the shopping experience definitely will be a good one. It's spacious, the corridors, the aisles are huge. There's like a lot of options here. So I'm very much excited about this. And again, thank you to my lovely shopper for suggesting Nesto Hypermarket. If you're in Dubai and there are some supermarkets that you want me to check out, let me know in the comments. I'm always interested and eager to hear you. So hit me up in those comments. Because it's my first time here at Nesto Hypermarket, we will do a little browsing. I'll show you guys the different products that's available, the prices and then we're going to stick to our shopping list this is the week this is the month that we're going to start our weekly shopping and meal planning and like i told you from the previous video i am sticking to my list this month so i hope you guys are ready to do some weekly shopping and weekly meal plan so walking around nesto it reminds me of lulu this is huge there's different sections so you have clothing there is appliances for the house. You can also buy refrigerators. It, it has pretty much everything in here. So it reminds me of Carrefour and Lulu's hypermarket here in Dubai. Anything that you want, you can pretty much get it here at Nesto, the hypermarkets. Shopping for clothes, shopping for your kitchen appliances, shopping for your house. So I have to come back and do a full tour of Nesto. I will do it in justice today, but we're gonna come back and do a full tour. We're just focusing on the groceries today. It's so crazy because I've been here in Dubai for over six years and have never been to a Nesto hypermarket. There's so many things that I'm missing out here, but I'm great. It's so, I'm so grateful for my lovely shoppers because they, they give me a ton load of suggestions of great places to check out so my shopping experiences can be better so we all can become better shoppers if you want to become better shoppers too and you haven't joined the family please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and while you're at it turn on the notification bell so you are notified whenever i upload any video and once you subscribe hit me up in those comments everyone reads those comments help us all become better shoppers Okay guys, so this is just a quick preview of the other areas and we're gonna head now to the grocery section and I'll show you the products and the prices. Just a quick preview. I have to come back, I will come back. So again, if you're interested in to see what Nesto Hypermarket is like here in Dubai, make sure you hit that subscribe button and you turn on the notification. You don't wanna miss this tour. What I found the best thing to do when making your meal plan is first to go over your pantry to see what you have available make your meal plan around that and just build upon what you already have this week our challenge one protein five different meals our protein of choice will be chicken i know having one protein can be very boring but this week i will share with you five different meal options that would have your family and yourself and the taste buds jumping with flavor i know that you're very curious to know what can those five meal plans be that would have your taste buds jumping like i told you we are checking what we have in our pantry and i had a lot of ramen noodles left over so what we're gonna do we're gonna do first a new chicken noodles bowl and this is your typical ramen noodles because we ain't using the seasoning from the packet we are creating our tasteful broth 
we're gonna dip the noodles in the broth we're gonna have some carrots we'll have some egg boiled egg and also some bean sprouts so this is like a loaded noodles on steroids the second dish also going with the ramen noodles and again we're just using the ramen noodles we're not using the seasoning and if you don't want to use the ramen noodles you can always get those egg noodles or pasta whatever noodles you prefer to use but we're going to make a chicken and broccoli ramen stir fry again we are creating our delicious rich um, sauce oyster sauce soy sauce brown sugar garlic it's gonna be very flavorful so those are two dishes so far and those will be using the ramen noodles so you know that is low budget meal so this will be the main component for our two chicken meals i'm going to get two of these because once i prepare dinner it would also be used for lunch the following day so i have one at home i'll just get two more and these are 12.50 for a pack of five. I just noticed that the vegetable ramen noodles is one durum cheaper. Because we're not using the seasoned package, I'm just gonna go ahead with that. So I'll put back the chicken and I'll just get the vegetable ramen noodles. Save some money. So there's a lot of different ramen noodles options. So you can just get your favorite brand. And if you wanna use the package seasoning, you can go right ahead and do it because it will taste just as great. Well, that's not true. <laughs> My one will taste better. But you can go ahead and use the packet seasoning to get a nice broth as well. I know pasta is usually a staple in many homes. So the prices here, you have $4.99 for this pasta. What I would say is I haven't noticed any Nesto brand. So I'm not sure if Nesto produces any of its own products here in the store. The main component of the noodles dish would be the broth. You want that rich, tasty broth to dip your noodles and vegetables in. A lot of people might use chicken stock, but what I usually do is use some chicken cubes. I'll show you the one that I use. So I would go ahead with these Maggi cubes. They're $26.50. You have chicken, you have beef, and you have vegetables. I would usually get the vegetable cubes and I'll add them to my the water for my rice, soups, noodles, like it gives that flavor. So instead of having the chicken stock, you can use those cubes. These noodles can also be used for the stir fry and I believe the noodles, these Chinese noodles and these are $10.99 and it's uh, under the promotional section. So from the promotional section, we're gonna get some brown sugar and this price on promotion is $8.45. From the pro promotional section, we will get this lotus spread and it is for $19.25. We have this oyster sauce. This is 20 dirhams for a pack of two. We definitely won't need two and I don't think I'll use two bottles so quickly. So. If you use a lot of oyster sauce, this is probably a good promotion, but we won't need all of that. Some more promotional prices. You have mushrooms, canned mushrooms for $6.99. You have corn, $4.99. Del Monte chickpeas, $11.25. For my mango chicken bowl, we need some black beans, and these black beans are $9.00. 55 i'll get two of these black beans are either like a rare commodity here in dubai or they probably don't have much stock of them because i've never seen black beans in lulu's or carrefour because i was looking for those things and there was only two packets here so this seems to be the only selection of pasta sauces or pizza sauces available here at nesto look at the prices I can definitely get it somewhere else. So we will be doing shopping elsewhere as well. Let's talk breakfast options. So breakfast this week will be oat porridge, um, pancakes with blueberry compote. We have, what else do we have? We have um, scrambled egg and potatoes, breakfast wraps, smoothies, of course. So those are the options for breakfast. With the pancakes, I usually make my own pancakes from scratch. So I have to get some flour. We need some 
vanilla essence, some sugar as well, and some butter. So when I get the ingredients to make the pancake or even waffle, one batter can be used for both. If you don't want to make your pancake batter, you can always get these prepaid, pre-mixed batters. And this one here is 20 dirhams at Nesto. So we have some vanilla essence. This is 150 dirham. And we have the vanilla extract, which is 21.95. We're going to get some coconut milk for our coconut rice. I will go with our mango chicken. So you have different prices. This brand, it's 7.99. You have 6.75 as well for coconut milk and 6.25. We're gonna get some flour for our pancakes, our waffles, whatever I decide to make. This brand is 10 dirhams and it's for two kgs. We also have this brand. It is 16, 16.50 for two kgs of flour. We also have the larger bags as well. This is 41.75 for 10 kgs of flour. This is the brand of sugar that I normally get, 14 dirhams, but I'm gonna try the one on promotion. I'll go ahead and get this white sugar for 15.99 and it's five kgs. So I told you I didn't see any Nesto brands really, but I just saw this. And this says Nesto as well. So there are some Nesto brands around the place, but it doesn't seem like it's a lot of products. So there's a Filipino section here at Nesto. And this is a different selection of products. We have some oyster sauce. This will be used to create our sauce for the stuff fry. This here is $6.99. I believe this one here is either $8.99 or $9.50, I'm not sure. So we're gonna get this one for $6.99 and then we're gonna get some soy sauce as well. Okay, one thing I've noticed here is that the product line is pretty limited. Like for the oyster sauce, I'm not really finding a lot of selection off of the soy sauce. There isn't like low sodium, so the selection is quite limited, I must say. Well, that's what I've noticed so far at least. We have this soy sauce, it's $3.99 and also this soy sauce which is $2.99. In my everyday cooking, I use olive oil. So we're gonna get some of that. Again, the options here are quite limited, but let me show you what they have. I have this extra virgin olive oil. It's 21 dirhams for 500 liters. I am going to get this one here for 21 dirhams. this canola oil it's 28 dirhams for two liters this one is 20 dirhams for 1.5 liter this sunflower oil is 20 dirhams nor sunflower this is 24.95 so the prices of salt here at Nesto you have your pink Himalayan salt that is 10 dirhams Table salt, 250 for 700 grams. So beans are, are stable in a lot of households. So the price of beans here, you have 495 for these beans. Chickpeas, these are 875. These are 1025. One of our snacks for the week is popcorn. Popcorn is a healthy snack. I'm going to get this one and it is 14. So I told you guys that the um, soy sauce selection was a bit limited. That is because everything is over here in the Asia section. So there's a lot of options here. One of our snacks this week is mixed nuts. I'm going to get some almonds and cashews. The good thing about it, they're on sale here. So I'll get about 30 dirhams for each. I got some cranberries as well to go along with my almonds and cashews. I'll get some muffins for the boys as snacks to take to school. 
those are 10 dirhams. Ernesto has a bakery. Jonathan wants some macaroons. I think I'm going to get one or two for him to, he'll be so excited. So Ernesto has a bakery, but they don't bake their own bread which sucks because I prefer to get my bread from a bakery. But we'll see what they have. We're going to get some wraps for our breakfast wraps. This can also be quick lunches. We're gonna get about four of these and these are eight, nine to nine dirhams. Okay, so we, I found some bread that was made locally, I will assume. The expiration, the production date and the expiration date is quite close. So when I get some of these, bread I'm going to get some of these for the boys as snacks to eat with hummus these are full 50 so there's a butchery and a fishery here at Nesto you can get your fresh meat your fresh fish if you're brave enough or you want to sample the camel meat you can get it here at Nesto I'm seeing some very interesting things here look at this beef brain I don't think I've ever seen an animal brain part in a store before so if you're looking for all of your lamb testicles it's 11.26 lamb hot 16.7-7 kidneys 12.7-1 oh my goodness like every part of the animal is here you have chicken feet as well and this is six ninety nine. The cheese prices here fifteen twenty five for Irish cheddar. I got some turkey breasts for Jalen for his sandwiches because Jonathan really don't eat it. I was hoping to find a larger container of oats, but they just have these. I'll get about maybe four of these quick cooking oats and it's for five ninety nine dirhams. I was hoping to purchase some cereal as well, but I will not at these prices. We have some Carol corn flakes for 40 dirhams, frosted flakes for 38. So not at these prices. I'll just get my cereal from somewhere else. I'm going to get some of these snacks for the boys. It's $14.99 for a pack of 12. This is definitely a great sight to see. It's very difficult to find U.S. parboil rice, U.S. style parboil rice in the UAE. The only place I've seen it was in Lulu. So it's good to see it's also here in Nesto. So I'm gonna get some of this. This is $19.95 for five kgs of rice. So you have the large bags as well. Let me show them to you. If you're interested, you can get it here at Nesto. So the 20 kg bag is also available and I think that might be, how much is it? 59 dirhams. So from Nesto's bumper deal November, we're gonna get some Ritz and also some Oreos. The Ritz is 20 dirhams and the Oreos 31.95 for a pack of two. The Oreos are not individually I think it's just the cookies. We're not gonna get these because these would have been the snacks for the boys So I'm not gonna get the Oreos again. Just a Ritz crackers. Another November bumper saving 20 dirhams for this comfort and I'm going to get one of them We need some foil paper Nesto brand 200 square feet is for 28 Diamond You have this one here is 16. 200 square feet of diamond is 42. So we're gonna get some foil paper and some cling film. Some cleaning supplies. We're going to get some dish liquid. $18.99 for these two. We need to get some toilet paper. So we're gonna try this brand, $24.99 for 20 rolls. We're now entering my favorite section in the grocery store. The produce section. Look at those fruits. Yummy. We're going to get some mango for our mango chicken bowl. Ooh, 
Look at this. Sugar apple. I don't know the last time I've seen this. Custard apple. $13.99. I don't know the last time I saw some sugar apple. We call it sugar apple in Anguilla or in the Caribbean. Custard apple. Nice. Okay, so these mango. I'll get some mango for snacks and also for that um, mango chicken. One of the dinner meals would be a mango chicken bowl. We'll have mango grilled chicken, um, coconut rice, some plantain, and some black beans. So for the marinade, I'm going to blend some mangoes, add some spices, and let that marinate overnight. Minimum one hour, but I want to marinate it overnight so that juices can really seep through the chicken and it's going to be delicious. What I'm going to do, I'll just share some of my meal plan, the different options at the end of the video and probably some pictures as well. So you make sure to stay to the end. I'll also share the shopping list. All of that will be at the end of the video. The layout in the produce section is so cute. Look at this. I'm gonna get me some mushrooms. I'll get two packs of these and this will go for our breakfast options with that um, scrambled egg. I am going to be Jalen's best friend today. He's been asking me for some of these leeches and I'm going to get him a pack and it's 26 75 This is one of my favorite fruits. It's mangosteen and it's 16 dirhams for this pack. These bananas are the perfect size for the boys take to school for snack it's cool outside now here in Dubai so the boys spend more of their break time outside so the teacher encourages us to send snacks that they can easily eat on the go outside so I know they'll be happy for that how pretty everything is you cannot come to this section and leave feeling sad the produce section especially the fruits everything is so bright and vibrant you just feel happy when you're in, in the produce section or you're surrounded by fruits do you guys feel the same way or is it just me? It's so pretty in this section. This is why it's my favorite section. I'm sure it's yours too. And if it's not, it will be soon. <laughs> so I'm going to get this watermelon for the snacks. And we have a fruit salad. I, I don't eat watermelon, so I wouldn't be eating this. Talking about a fruit salad though, I am so excited to show you guys the honeydew that, was, that we grew in the backyard. The boys had some and it was so tasty, so I'll be having that in my salad. I don't like melon, but I sure will be eating some of that honey dew. We're going to get some kiwi. This is $12.99 for this pack. We're going to get some grapes. The price varies from $8.99 to $9.99. And these over here, our Iran seedless red grapes and those are $12.99 and these here are white grapes and they are $10.99 we're going to get some spring onions this will be for our fried rice and also the noodles broth we're also going to get some bok choy for our noodles we're going to get some potato this is $4.99 per kg this will go with our breakfast, scrambled eggs, mushrooms, and potatoes. One of the meals that we are having this week is also some grilled chicken with stuffed baked potato. So I'm gonna get some potato for that and also some potato for our breakfast. So one of the money saving tips when you're shopping or doing your meal plans is to get produce you can use multiple ways for different recipes. I got potato. This is using in the breakfast for breakfast potatoes and also as a side for one of my meals, stuffed loaded potatoes. We have blueberries, $6.99. We have these strawberries for 20 dirhams. A crate of strawberries is 65 dirhams. Another item for the noodle and also the stir fry, some bean sprouts and it is 10 dirhams. So get some broccoli and this is 17 dirhams. So we're having some avocado toast. Want to get some avocados? These are 15.99. Need to get this bag of orange. This is 15.99 and it will be used for the smoothies. 
I'm going to get some of this frozen whole chicken. It's $13.99. I'll get about four of these and then I'll get some chicken breasts as well. I'll get this mozzarella cheese. It's 26 dirhams to go with a pizza crust that I just picked up for 14 dirhams. I'll get this yogurt for six dirhams to add to the smoothies and also have as a snack with granola. I'm done with my shopping here at Nesto. Usually I try to stick within a thousand dirhams, but I don't think it's gonna to happen today because we purchased stuff other than groceries, which we had to. Final tally is under a thousand. Another challenge accomplished. Okay, my beautiful shoppers, that's it for our Nesto haul. I hope you enjoyed the tour. And remember, this week is our week, our month of weekly meal planning and weekly shopping. If you haven't joined the family as yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads.